Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a little winter luxury haul. I have a couple handbags to show you and some accessories that I've picked up and I've been doing some Black Friday shopping. I actually got some things for Christmas which I will be showing you in a what I got for Christmas video at a later date. I've actually wrapped things and put them under the tree for myself. I know it's crazy but I wanted to show you these things that I bought that I will be using right away or have been using so far that I think are actually really perfect for the winter season and for the holiday season. So I'm excited to share these pieces with you. But if you're new here, welcome. My name is Alyssa and I have a blog called The Gals Guide and I come on here and I review my luxury and contemporary handbags. So if you love handbags as much as I do, you should definitely consider subscribing down below. Hit that little red button. I would love to have you join this little community with me here. And to my current subscribers, thank you so much for being here. I'm so grateful for you. I love chatting with you in the comments down below and I just genuinely appreciate your support. So that being said, let's get into the video. So I'm gonna start with the handbags. So this first handbag is actually a dupe that I found at my local TJ Maxx and I am in shock at this little bag. This is a dupe for the Alexander Wang like diamond, I don't even know, the Alexander Wang bag that's super popular right now. When I saw this, I just couldn't believe it. Like I, I saw it and I went, I just have to have that. I don't know what it is. I don't know where I'm going to wear it, but I cannot wait to wear it for the holidays. It came with this really beautiful chain strap. It's super thick and it has this really nice little like prong to put it on there. And so I don't know what this is, but it's by Expressions NYC EN Luxury Vegan Handbag. So it is, um, this is definitely a brand that I'm going to end up looking up on Instagram. They do have their Instagram handle here. I've never heard of them before, but I will definitely be checking them out. This is such a cute little bag. It's stuffed, so I'm going to take the stuffing out. But it's just like a lightweight, perfect little holiday bag, and I just love it. I think it's so cute. I'm going to wear it like on the crook of my arm or with this little crossbody strap. Like this is a really nice strap, and I just thought this was perfect for like New Year's Eve or Christmas Eve or Christmas Day or whatever you celebrate. If you're going to a holiday party, this would be a really cute bag. I'm going to see if they have a website, and I can see if they actually have this on there. I got this for $24.99. So the Alexander Wang bags are definitely way more than this, but I believe the Wang bags have like Wang written here with like a kind of a zipper pull or something like that. I haven't looked into it too much, but I just thought this was absolutely stunning and I could not wait to share this. The next bag I actually found at my local Saks Off Fifth outlet and it is this little Versace jeans couture bag. I've never bought anything from the Versace jeans couture line. I really love Versace bags though, but when I saw this with the black chunky chain like that, I thought it was so cute and really will match a ton. And I love this shape of this bag. It honestly is similar to like the Prada re-edition kind of style. I also like that this silver crossbody is removable. The black strap is not removable so it does stay on but I love it like I think it's so cute I don't know if they have this online but I will check and link it in the description box I have been wearing this already and this is the inside it is pretty spacious you can get just about everything you need in here I'll show you I have my iPhone 12 Pro and it does fit in there really nicely actually so you can see you've got a lot of room to get stuff in and there are some like little pockets so you have a pocket in the back a pocket in the front you have two different pockets in here so it's really convenient I would say a nylon bag is you know a little bit tough because it does show like lint and things like that which I don't love but it's really easy to just grab and go it's a really great casual bag I have a Prada bucket bag in the nylon that I absolutely love it's such a great casual everyday bag and I think that this is going to be similar but almost a little bit more dressy with the chains and like edgy which I really really like I'll be wearing this a lot this season I've been wearing it out running errands and I just think it's so functional 
It also does not have feet on the bottom, but it is pretty structured. You can see the sides are really nicely put together. And I ended up getting this for under $200, which I thought was great. Next up, I have two more things to show you. One of them is a small leather good, and I got this from my local outlet. And I learned that Kate Spade is actually owned by the same people that own Coach, which I did not know. But I got this little Kate Spade wallet, and it's houndstooth. I have never seen anything quite like this. I think that houndstooth is a really nice pattern for the winter time. I love mixing this with other colors as well. It has this nice back pocket back here, and it is a zip. It's a super smooth zipper. Oops, and you have all of the compartments in here. So this was listed for $129.99, and it was like 70% off. I ended up getting this for like $33, where I was like, this is a no-brainer, like why wouldn't I get this? So it has so many compartments in here. I love the zipper in the center. You could put like your coins and stuff, which I don't usually have change, but just in case, just something to note. This is a really nice size and I'll actually show you it'll fit right in the Versace bag. It does take up quite a bit of room, so you couldn't really do like multiple small leather goods in here, but you can see that it's a good size for a mini bag and it will fit right in there. I just loved the pattern on this. Like, I think it's so pretty. This is the Saffiano leather, I believe. Kind of has that rough feel to it, which is usually not my favorite leather, but I think this is going to be really durable as a little wallet. So I can't wait to fill this, and I'm probably going to do an updated small leather goods video because I've gotten a few things lately that I wanted to show you more of. So I'm actually going to throw a pair of sneakers in here, which I wasn't planning on showing, just in case I have some sneaker people out there. I want to show you what I picked up. So I got these at my local outlet. I don't know exactly what they are, but I think they're so cool. I loved this colorway. And I got these for $60. These are definitely way more than $60 on the Nike website. So this is just to encourage you, go to your local outlet if you wanna find cool sneakers. They came in this box and they're called, I don't even know how to say this name, but that's what they're called. And I literally couldn't believe the price point. These honestly feel like a sock going on your foot. Like they're super, super comfortable. And I just honestly think that they're super cool and different from anything that I have. So I just wanted to share them with you in case you're interested. Last but not least, I did buy this on Black Friday. So I bought this from Kendra Scott. It is a necklace and it is like a gold choker kind of look. And it has these little gems throughout. These are not real diamonds, but they're like different shapes. So one is a square, one is like a heart shape. So they alternate and they go heart shape square, heart shape square, and it's super, super pretty. It's just a really chunky chain that I think is going to look really cute on, and you can obviously like adjust the length based on where you want it. This necklace retailed for $125, and I am getting it for like 70 something dollars, which I didn't think was terrible. I thought it was so pretty for Kendra Scott. I really love her jewelry. The quality is really beautiful, and I've honestly never Never seen anything like this particular piece so I thought it was worth it I like to get chunky jewelry to wear especially in the winter I don't know why I just think with a sweater with a chunky necklace it just looks so beautiful and honestly I think this is really gonna dress up a lot of my holiday outfits so I'm very excited about this so that is going to conclude this video thank you so much for watching if you're still here with me and if you have any questions about any of these items please feel free to leave that in the comments down below thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video